In Ad 95, King Orvindal returns to the fictional island of Hraffensee after his overseas conquests, reuniting with his wife, Queen Gudrun, and his heir, Prince Amleth. To prepare Amleth for his eventual ascension, the father and son participate in a ceremony overseen by Orvindal's jester Hymer. Hymer tells Amleth that his destiny is fixed and cannot be escaped, and Amleth vows to avenge his father if Orvindal is ever slain, rather than live his life in shame. The next morning Amleth's bastard uncle Fiendr stages a palace coup, personally beheads Orvindal, sacks the hill fort, and carries away Gudrun. Amleth narrowly escapes Fiendr's assassins and flees by boat, swearing vengeance. Years later, an adult Amleth is in Ulfinian with a band of Vikings. After attacking a village in Gardariki, Amleth encounters a Cirrus in the Temple of Svetavit. The Cirrus says that it is Odin's will for Amleth to take his revenge on Fiendr, and advises Amleth to follow the vixen's tail, and that his fate is intertwined with that of a maiden king. Soon after Amleth learns that, Fiendr the Brotherless, has lost his throne to King Harald Fairhair of Norway, and now lives as a sheep farmer in Iceland. Cutting his hair and posing as a slave, Amleth sneaks aboard a ship. He encounters an enslaved Slavic woman named Olga, who claims to be a sorceress. They are taken to Fiendr's farm, where Amleth learns his mother has married Fiendr and borne him a son named Gunnar. One night Amleth follows a vixen and encounters a he-witch, who facilitates a spiritual dialogue between Amleth and the skull of Hymer, whom Fiendr has also murdered. The he which also tells Amleth about Droger, a magical sword at the gates of hell. Amleth enters a mound and obtains the blade after fighting the undead mound dweller. He hides the sword upon his return to the farm. The next day, Amleth is selected to compete in a game of Nadaliker against another farm. The game turns violent and Gunnar is almost killed, but Amleth saves him. As a reward, Fiendr's adult son Thor grants him overseer duties and allows him to choose a woman. During the evening celebrations, Amleth and Olga make love. They promise to overcome Fiendr together. Amleth kills several of Fiendr's men, and Olga mixes their food with fly agaric, a potent hallucinogen. The ensuing chaos and the suspicion that the Christian slaves are behind the killings allows Amleth to enter Fiendr's house. Gudrun also reveals that she masterminded Fiendr's coup because she wanted both Orvindal and Amleth dead. She then tries to seduce Amleth, who after a moment, rejects her. Enraged, Amleth kills Thor, and then cuts out and steals his heart. Gudrun reveals Amleth's true identity to Fiendr and calls for the death of her eldest son. Fiendr decides to kill Olga, but Amleth offers to trade Olga's life for Thor's heart. After a severe beating, Amleth is released from his restraints by a flock of ravens sent by Odin. Olga also rescues Amleth, who tells her that his mother has murdered his past. Amleth decides to abandon his quest for revenge, and the two decide to escape by boat to his kinsmen in the Orkney Islands. But Amleth then has a vision and discovers that Olga is pregnant with twins, one of whom will be the maiden king prophesied by the Cirrus. Realizing that Olga and their children will never be safe while Fiendr lives, Amleth, despite Olga's pleas, jumps overboard and swims ashore. Back at the farm, Amleth frees the slaves and kills Fiendr's warriors. While searching for Fiendr, Amleth is attacked by Gudrun and drives Droger through her heart. Gunnar jumps on Amleth's back, stabbing his half-brother repeatedly until Amleth kills him too. Fiendr, discovering his wife and son dead, coldly tells Amleth to meet him at the gates of hell, at the crater of the volcano Hecla, Amleth and Fiendr engage in a fierce home gang until Fiendr is beheaded and Amleth is fatally stabbed simultaneously. As he lies dying, Amleth has a vision of Olga embracing their two children, whom she tells him are safe, before urging him to let go. A Valkyrie carries Amleth through the gates of Valhall, Valhalla.